Wayne did plead guilty. He is facing 10 years. He's not going to do 10 years. What's going to happen is the judge is going to sentence him at the end of January. In this case, most likely, Little Wayne and the prosecutors have worked out some sort of deal where Little Wayne's not going to fight the charges and they're not going to try to throw the book at him. Typically, people are used to people are confused because you're used to state court where when you plead guilty, you get the deal, whatever it was. That's, you know, hey, I won't fight these charges. In this case, this is federal. Wayne is in federal court. He's in federal court because he got caught with an illegal gun while flying from California to Florida. In federal court, you and the prosecutor can't agree to a deal. The prosecutor can only recommend to the judge what to give you. What can the judge give you? Some cases have mandatory minimums. Here, I don't think there's a mandatory minimum because Wayne just has one prior gun charge. This is not a crime of violence. No mandatory minimum. Judge is going to be able to give him whatever he wants. So if the government recommends nothing, and the government might recommend nothing, after all, Wayne vouched for Trump in front of the whole culture. The prosecutors, these are still Trump's prosecutors. Also, this is not really a serious crime. The man had a gold-plated gun. It could have been a gift. It could have been a memento. He's a millionaire flying on a private jet. He is not the type of person doing the type of things that the federal gun laws are meant to go and incriminate, that the federal sentencing guidelines are meant to go throw the football numbers at. That's just not what this case is. So you look at all those factors, how quickly this plea deal has been entered, and what I suspect to happen over the next couple of weeks, the government's going to make a recommendation to the judge that, you know, judge, this guy's a nice guy, you know, the president likes him. I don't think they're going to say that. But I think that's going to be one of the reasons why they say what they say. Anyway, they're going to say, you know, judge, maybe you give him nothing. And the judge will probably say, all right. Screw it. You don't want to give him nothing. There's no mandatory minimum. I'll give him nothing. So that's my opinion. That's what I expect. We'll have the answer probably by mid-January when the government releases their recommendation. That'll be a pretty sure sign of what's going to happen. And then by the end of January, that sense will come out from the judge. Good luck to Lil Wayne.